All right, let's look at pH changes qualitatively. That means not quantitative numbers. This is just kind of understanding what is going on in a conceptual uh, manner. Uh, so we're gonna look at, uh, on the left, some initial components, right over here. Then we're gonna add something and we're gonna see what happens. We're gonna think about it. Uh, so let's go through these uh, one at a time. That's what you're gonna do in this objective. And so our initial components in A is purely water. Now, if it's just water, it's gonna be neutral. Now I add something. Now the question is, am I adding a salt of some sort, uh, or am I adding a, an acid or a base? An acid's gonna have that hydrogen on it. A base is gonna have typically an OH on it uh, of some sort. Uh, salts are going to be those ionically bonded um, components with a metal and a, a non-metal, um, not OH-based. Um, and so let's look at what we got here. Okay, so we are adding a salt. So that's not going to change anything. It's going to break into ions. We're going to have sodium ions and iodine ions, but no uh, OH minuses or uh, pH pluses, and it's not going to react with water to create one of those H3O plus or OH minus. Uh, okay, so next we got again a neutral water, but now we are adding NaOH, right, which can break up into Na and OH minus. So that is going to make the P, and remember, pH, we got 14, we got zero, we got seven neutral. Uh, basic up here, acidic down here. So pH will go up if it becomes more basic. We got OH minus is up here and we got H3O plus is down here. So pH is gonna go higher. Okay, here we got water and a base. So this is gonna start basic, so pH high, and then we're adding an acid, nitric acid here. This hydrogen can uh, react with water to form our H3O plus. And so we are gonna lower the pH. Here again, we have a basic start and we're gonna add KNO3. So now we're adding the salt. So the NO3 doesn't do anything uh, and so potassium, that's not going to do anything. So that is not going to change the pH. So each time we're making an analysis, what's going on? What are we starting with? What are we adding? What is that going to do to the pH? There we go.